here in Aosalane Bay. Two hours excursion. This is very nice. More than I expected. During the last four months, we've been traveling around Thailand. And if you've been watching our previous episodes, you might have seen we are kinda heading south. After a few days in Phuket trying some of the best food and admiring the Phuket Old Town, the usual next stop for travelers is Krabi. And we have to confess, Krabi has become one of our favorite places in Thailand. We felt some kind of connection that we didn't feel in other places, and we ended up spending more days there than we planned. Krabi is one of those places that has it all. My god! Pristine beaches hidden in remote islands, dense forests and jungles, challenging hikes with rewarding views, and a vibrant mix of Muslim, Buddhist, and Chinese Thai influences. We did a lot of things here. And on in this mini series, we'll show you one by one the best things to do in Krabi. Hey guys, welcome back to our channel. We are in the west part of the beautiful province of Krabi. Krabi is mostly known for its beaches and islands, but on this episode we are going to show you a bit of the amazing jungle landscape you can find here. Starting from these incredible roads that you can enjoy just renting a motorbike and wandering around. We are now heading to Quan Nom Sao, a viewpoint up a hill somewhere in the middle of nowhere. But first, we will stop for lunch in front of the ocean to try some of Krabi's famous seafood. And they say here in Krabi, uh, seafood is a must. So we just ordered the soft shell crab with chili and garlic. It's very yum. Yeah? Yo. I'm not sure what kind of crab it is. Um, I don't know. And we got the mussels in Thai herbs. Herbs being lemongrass, the one the most. And maybe some kefir lime. Oh, These mussels are wow. huge, man. Look at this. <gasps> Very mm. herby. Wow. Oh, man. This is Thailand in your mouth. Thailand mm. <laughs> in your mouth? I really love these flavors, you know, these herbs, mm. right? Mm -hmm. It's not Amazing. that much food, but we're not super hungry. I mean, we're hungry, but, you know, seafood is not that cheap. We could have some rice maybe, or mm -hmm. I don't know. You know, maybe one fried rice or something. We're going to finish this and see if we are more hungry, because we might go later to another cafe spot. Chairs here for the oh table. My god. Oh my god. This is, this is crazy, man. <laughs> wow. It's crazy. So we have reached to the viewpoint. On the way up here was a little bit uh, tricky, uh, very bumpy and uh, kind of like not well paved road but it's so worth it the view is one of the best i've ever seen during the whole trip in thailand the view point 
is absolutely amazing still we're not on the top but still the view is so gorgeous and down below we just had the coffee coffee and some Thai tea there's a very small but uh, with a great view uh, there's a cafe and restaurant so if you are if you want to take rest with a gorgeous view you can also have some drinks there or even they also have some food but anyway this is this is nice and not only there's a cafe and restaurant there's also like a camping site here where there's some tents and you can stay here and I can imagine the stars you might see at night because there's no you know there's no cities around there's no uh, light pollution oh my god but you can see this oh my god holy moly look my at this god. kind of a deck Oh, someone's burning there oh look at the cloud this is the sunset point guys uh, the sun is right there Let's keep exploring. Let's see if we can find this camping. Oh my God, the swings. It's very nice. You can tell they've worked hard on this because this is the path to here. It's a bit tricky, but they brought a lot of woods. See all these fences and all. And here we see one of the tents. Hello. So cool. They are, I guess, tents for two people. Not more. Wow. What? I'm not sure where the sunrise. There. Oh, so it might be amazing. Eh? Yeah, you see sunrise here. Cool. Wow. You want to stay here one night? One night? No, I wouldn't mind. Oh, another tent. But one night? Not bad. It would be a fun experience. Guys, as you can see, the landscape is spectacular. I mean, we have to leave, but I would spend here until sunset, at least. Wow, even look at this table. Hello. It's very beautiful, very nice. See, they're preparing tents and this mattress or cushions. Oh, barbecue. Can you imagine here cooking something at night when sunset? Oh, shells. Of course, seafood. We're in the coast zone. This gentleman just told us what? these are cashew nuts. I mean, this is a oh, okay. cashew apple. Exactly. Oh, we should make some more rack. No? These are cashew apples to make cashew nuts. Oh my God, and I don't know what it is, but... Oh, don't tell me it's a beehive. Ooh. <gasps> what the hell is this? Spider webs, no? Oh, no, silkworm, maybe. Hmm. I don't know, but this is full of cashew. Look at this cashew tree. Full of cashew nuts everywhere. It's full. This one is kind of ripe. Another tent here. Oh my God! Look at the views. Can you imagine staying here, man? All right, so with these amazing views, it's time <laughs> to wrap up this episode and say goodbye. Yeah. So, if you like this episode, please give it a thumbs up. And if you're new here, please make sure to subscribe to our channel. And hit the notification bell so you don't miss further episodes. Thank you so much for watching and see you on the next one. Bye. Bye.